matchup. <laughs> and I'm back. Fox Toon Link, what do you think? Uh, good for Fox. Really? Yeah. Uh, I I think Fox just has a lot better uh, damage output. He can uh, he can run past Toon Link's projectiles pretty well. Approach with dash attack. Yeah, look at all the reads that uh, these players are making right now. Is, uh, yeah, the forward smash reads. <laughs> well, we got... Uh, ooh. The Nair was pretty good, but he didn't quite cover Redude the Dude 83 versus Henry the Eighth. Henry the Eighth. I like it. I'm glad that you can read these and eyes into numbers. Uh, slight lead on Fox's part here, so maybe your prediction is true, but uh, that was an interesting decision, but really small punish for it. It, it is one of those matchups where uh, Fox is going to have a hard time recovering when Toon Link plays his cards right because he can throw out something to intercept the side B and just cover multiple options at once using his projectiles and himself. Ah, uh, makes sense. Oh, that was a really good up smash trade. Yep. I think he, uh, I think he read the, the bomb pull there and just... That's what we call Still GameStop trade. Anyone that has ever traded anything at GameStop will get that reference. Ooh, good jab. Interrupting the down air. Oh, ooh. Some nice little combos uh, by Doom Link here. Just kind of putting, putting his projectiles in the air and taking advantage of the situations they create. Yep. But, uh, ooh. Oh, oh, he had the read, but he released a little too early. Mm -hmm. It was unfortunate. Boomerang saving him there from that forward air, though. Oh, uh, that uppy. Catches him. Just barely clipped him, but not enough to kill across the stage, at least. That's a good up smash. All right, there we go. Ooh, I like how the bomb kind of uh, interrupted that down air. Like, a lot of these down airs are getting interrupted. And, oh. Didn't quite follow up on that correctly, but Fox does have the capability to do that. If he can, if he lands a good down air on you, especially at kill percent, it can lead straight into up smash and you can just die at 100. Oh, ooh, good power shield. The down smash punish was really good. I like, like the punish game is really nice, uh, and he's got the projectiles, but he doesn't look like he's necessarily like zoning with them. Like Fox is getting inside really easily, but ooh. Grab him, put him off stage. Let's see if he can edge guard it. I think uh, that we do is be a little uh, too proactive about this edge guard. He needs to be a little more reactive. Yeah. Ooh. He has brought it back though. Yeah, this was, this is definitely looking close. I mean, at the start of this game, we saw Fox with a slight advantage, especially taking the first stock. But uh, it looks like uh, we do doing a better job at uh, putting up a wall. Ooh. Just keeping him out that way. Keeps clipping him, clipping him with those uh, uppies. Ooh, caught the bomb, but not far enough to punish him with it. The reflector seems like it would be a really good tool in this matchup, but I haven't seen it. Um, uh, kind of. It can kind of get me down. It is pretty good in the sense that if you actually do reflect something, you can jump out of it almost instantly. Really? Uh, reminiscent of. Uh, melee shine. Good back air to co finish that game. Yeah, so if you reflect something, you can roll out of it, you can jump out of it. But that's only if you reflect something. Yep, if you whiff the reflect, then you're stuck there and you have to go through the whole ending of it and all that. that but sense. that means you could reflect like the boomerang back and then run forward. Alright, well, um... Henry took that game one, didn't he, with the down yeah. smash? Yeah. So that means we've got uh, We Dude's counter pick minus Henry's ban, but looks like we're just going to Battlefield. Interesting stage decision. I feel like Toon Link has less space to set up a projective wall, but that's not exactly what he's going for in this matchup anyway. It seems like he's playing a bit more inside. Ooh. Good patience on Henry's part. He's waiting out the up so he doesn't get caught out of it. Out of the uh, side B. I want to call it Phantasm, but it's not Phantasm. Illusion. Illusion, thank you. Oh, I can, yeah, I kind of see what you mean now. When yeah. he actually reflects something, it's pretty lagging. That was a good nair, but it didn't quite cover the uh, air dodge. Oh. K 
can you counter Azair? I'm wondering. Or counter Azair? Or, or, or reflect it, rather. No. So you can't... Uh, it's not a projectile, it's just a... It's like a disjointed hitbox. Okay. So I feel like that would be a really good or tool. Or transcended. Yeah, I feel like that would be a really good tool in this matchup if uh, Fox was uh, having a good, great finding success in uh, reflecting the projectiles. Back to yeah, but like you said earlier, it's a little bit of a risky option because if you whiff it, then you're a sitting duck. Yeah, okay. Oh, oh the down air. I think you want to do a jump and get up into that. Ooh, hits yeah, him with the F tilt. That kind of SD really hurts your mindset because you're already down a game. You know, you got to gotta bring it back. But he's doing a good job right yeah, now. He, he reset it, it which up. is good. Mm -hmm. But if you're down like that and then you happen to SD, you know, now, you, now you're down a game and also you're down in the game. Yeah, very, very unfortunate situation to be in. But, uh, ooh. 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 He, he, had had the, he had him in a really yeah. good spot. But yeah, he had the right idea there. Ooh. I think he's just like trying to drop down and cover too many low options, and then Henry right. keeps just getting re to recover up high, which is how he would rather recover anyway. Yeah, he's gotta, he's gotta, gotta read those uh, high low mix ups. Yeah, like I, I feel like it would be easier to cover a fox's recovery up high, because if he tries to recover low and has to use his up B, then it's pretty easy to react to. Ooh, Ooh, again with the read. There's oh. the read again, and just a little too soon. It's it's almost like he's reacting to the air dodge, except his his reaction to the air dodge is to throw out throw out the hitbox after he sees the air dodge. He needs to wait for it to end. Ooh. I also think he would have been able to punish that illusion if he had uh, neared instead of what looked to, looked to be a fair. Slight bomb punish, making it so the fox couldn't follow that up, but it didn't look like he was going to be able to anyway. Ooh, Ooh. the up air interrupted Did he get the both hits? No, he only took one hit. Wow. Oh, there and the up smash takes it. Ooh, close. All right. All right. That was a really close game, too. Nope. All right. We do turning it up. Trying to bring this back. Even after an SD. Still brought it back and uh, took it away. Mm-hmm. So I'm thinking um, Toon Link's going to want smaller stages so he can fight Fox more off stage. And uh, oh, that would make sense with the battlefield pick. I actually kind of disagree with the battlefield pick because that gives Fox a lot of options for uh, side being back to platforms and just using those to recover uh -oh. instead of always going to the ledge or going on stage. It just gives it opens more stuff up to him. Well, it looks like but we're back to FD to yeah, avoid we're that. Seeing, we're seeing uh, Henry take him to FD, which is, I think that is the right choice. Gives him lots of, of room to run around these projectiles and play on stage as much as possible. Hmm. Ooh. We have I an interesting punish there. Maybe not optimal, but that is the type of thing that you could, you could do just to get inside someone's head. Yeah, I I think that uh, ooh, ooh, that was a really good string. So two, we do's got a pretty good solid lead He's here. He's starting this game off strong. Yeah. Ooh. He was just playing some uh, pretty good spacing with it with his attacks earlier. Henry answering back ooh. though. Ooh, that clipped him. He Not turned that he turned that around. Oh, all right. Nice heck, but we're living though. Ooh. All right, we do. Ooh. Good jab. Get him back off stage. Just patiently waited. Yep. I think if the, if he was going for that kind of motion, Illusion would have been a better option to do the same kind of thing, recover on stage at that angle. Oh. Ooh, the power shield is good. I, I really like the how good the, he is at uh, punishing when uh, Henry whiffs something. But yeah. the, the other thing I'm noticing is that every time that Henry gets knocked off stage in, the, in a precarious position, he either will go for the instant side beam or he'll try and jump and go for the side Ooh. beam. Looked Ooh. at the bomb, tried to follow up with the up smash, but he got the weak hit. Ooh, good dash attack. Nice up tilt, and yeah, up air to cover the air dodge is really a uh, solid option. Throws the, throws the boomerang out. I wonder if he was trying to like hit him out and then have the boomerang there to cover it. 
Gotta watch the air dodges. Avoids the Roll away. Ooh. Everyone rolls away. Everyone rolls away. Guys, if you... Oh, oh my, my goodness. goodness. Just right. barely not making hits. It's okay. He's got some leeway here. This is, a, this this is an opportunity for Henry. This is 110% of extra credit. Oh, again. Oh, he reads the, the air dodge and releases it too early. Oh. That's like three stops. That is. They were all at kill percent, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, risky hold of the jab there. I like I liked uh, what we do did how he kind of like let like uh, let his shield drop momentarily and then flashed it back on. That way uh, it would bait Henry into releasing the jab, but then by the time that it does, it would be on the shield. So then he was able to punish it. Oof. Over a hundred percent lead, but oh, not quite more, able to take out the stock yet. More that are uh, Oof. released too early. Henry actually doing a good job of covering uh, We Dude's air dodge habit, but up oh, jumps over the projectile and avoids. Hey, he's pretty close to a uh, one setup away from an up smash. Yeah, victory like that, like you know, with the amount of rage. Oh, the back, the back but throw. I think that's isn't it like the second strongest back throw in the whole so game. Something like that. It's, it's ridiculous. It's so fast too. It's like ridiculous. you can't react to that. You can't like di it because you don't expect it to happen. I don't think it.